All right, welcome back to Power Lunch. Regional banks getting swept up in the sell-off, down 5% this week as the broader financial sector, it just grinds lower. Falling bond yields adding to the pressure as concerns spike around the global economic recovery with Japan declaring a COVID-related state of emergency in Tokyo ahead of the Summer Olympics. So is this a buying opportunity in those regional bank stocks or are they no touch? Let's dive into the technicals with your Trading Nation team today. Craig Johnson of Piper Sandler and Bill Baruch of Blue Line Capital. Gentlemen, thanks for being here. Thank you. Craig, we're going to kick things off with thanks you. Lot. Is there a near-term recovery in store for this group? Well, you know, Frank, I'd put it this way. I'd call you know, it we, shaken but not stirred, right? So from our perspective, as I look at this overall market here, I can see that as we've seen this sort of correction happening in 10-year bond yields, we've seen pressure uh, happening for all these regional banks. And what we basically have seen is just sort of a bit of a breakdown. But again, I think it's still the right place to be is to be overweight the financial sector. And again, I think this little shakeout is just that, a little shakeout. You'll find really good support at the uh, rising 200-day moving average, which is just below where we're at. And again, I would be buying some of these, uh, these uh, financials on the, on the weakness here, Frank. Bill, I'll turn it over to you. Do you see that support at the same level? Yeah, you know what? I added to a KRE, a name we've owned for a while, a name that, that I said I added to today. I raised a little bit of cash in some of these high growth names ahead of the Fed minutes yesterday and used that cash here. Overall, I, I now speaking of those uh, of those high growth names, it's been the yields, the precipitous drop in yields that has powered a lot of those. And, and inversely, um, it's hurt the banking sector. But the reality is the banking sector uh, has there's a lot of activity. People are using credit, and I think the second half is going to be terrific. So on a technical basis, we we went below about 63 and a half. That was a floor area, uh, and I, I like to see it regain that pretty quickly. But we are coming into the 618 retracement. We bounced off that here today, and a good a good settlement on the week would actually do a lot in in, in helping form a near term bottom. But also I'm looking at the ADX. The ADX has had lower peaks going back a bit, and I think we're the ADX is showing a trend, and the trend recently has been down. So I think that that downtrend is could turn here as the ADX tops out itself. So again, I think uh, the KRE and the banking sector is going to perform very well in the second half, and I'm using this as a buying opportunity.